Putin is building his policy on example of Hitler. In his latest interview, Russian President Vladimir Putin clearly demonstrated that his policy is based on Hitler's Nazism. This was stated by the acting permanent representative of Ukraine to the international organizations in Vienna, Victoria Kovshinikova, at a meeting of the OSCE Permanent Council. Someone may ask where this extreme disregard for the lives of innocent people came from. Vladimir Putin's latest statements give a clear idea of its nature. As always, it was again a mixture of falsified history, disinformation and lies, the diplomat said. According to her, Putin once again repeated that Ukraine allegedly never existed and that Ukrainians have never been another people. This is exactly what Putin was guided by when he started his aggression against Ukraine 10 years ago. And this explains why Russia today is focused on destroying the Ukrainian nation. Because when someone denies someone's right to exist, it always ends in mass murder. Because such a denial always gives a false reason for genocidal atrocities, Kovshinivkova said. She emphasized that Putin's statements were more eloquent than ever. It is now more than clear where Russia is copying its policy of racism from. After Putin said that Hitler was forced to start a world war because his neighbors were uncompromising about his territorial demands. Of course, it is ironic that Russia's so-called fight against neo-Nazism ended up justifying Nazism itself. However, was it not a hint that Ukraine should satisfy Russia's territorial claims? The diplomat noted. Earlier, Putin said, in his interview with American TV host Tucker Carlson, that the Poles got too excited and forced Hitler to start World War II with them.